This is your AFN Afghanistan Freedom Watch update. I'm Petty Officer Scott Bork. SFAT teams are no stranger to technology. Army Sergeant Brian James explains how unmanned aerial vehicles help CFT Warrior complete its mission. Unmanned aerial vehicles like the Shadow have become an indispensable tool in cross-functional Team Warrior's arsenal. UAV maintainers mount the Shadow to its pneumatic launcher and perform pre-flight checks before mission. The engine roars as it prepares to launch into the sky to perform a remote reconnaissance mission. One of CFT Warrior's UAV maintainers believes this technology helps the ANSF in their day-to-day -day missions. I just thought it was a, a new way of the future. Everybody said that they were going to go unmanned, and I do believe that they could use the information very wisely to their advantage. I definitely think it'll be a, a very helpful aspect of day-to-day -day operations for them. These UAVs have become a well-utilized tool during Operation Enduring Freedom in a variety of different ways. UAV operators feel that they have an important role in CFT Warrior's mission. It, it's nice to know that you're in charge and you're, uh, and you're capable of handling such a high-tech piece of equipment that just helps out in so many ways. It's one of the best experiences I've had. Very rewarding. Only time will tell where technology in the U.S. Army will go next. But it seems that for CFT Warrior, the future is now. Reporting from Ghazni Province, I'm Army Sergeant Brian James. And that's your AFN Afghanistan Freedom Watch update. I'm Petty Officer Scott Bork. Thanks for watching.